Welcome to our first edition of Polyphoria costumes on MetaHumans. As announced earlier this year, we ported our medieval NPC and armor products over to the MetaHuman base skeleton. Okay, let's take a look what we changed. We added a new folder and the character parts meshes MetaHumans for both genders, male and female. You have there the different chest pieces um, aligned to the MetaHuman base skeleton, as you can see here just open this chest piece everything is aligned to the tall normal weight body um, we decided to stick with these because these are the most generic ones um, for our um, base skeleton to work on okay here everything is on as you can see as well um, with the groom component from the meta human heads <coughs> and you can change here these um, different torsos depending on your need for sure. If you have to um, plug the hood on the character, you have to um, remove the hair component. <coughs> and this depends all on how you want to integrate these. Yeah, this as well with the spot trousers. Here um, I made a few um, pre-med samples, some villagers, some citizens, the rich people, and also the male. Everything is pretty easy to understand and forward. As mentioned before, we have these different folders here on the Meshes Meta Human. And the skeleton you can find in animation directly. Different samples with heads. This is for the medieval NPC. The cloth component is still missing. We're gonna add these uh, with another update in the ne near future. Here are our medieval armor dudes on the same skeleton. You can change the meshes here, as shown before. And this all works. Some northerners, the soldiers, a knight. It's all working <coughs> okay and yeah that's it from my side it was just a quick overview um, feel free to contact us in case you have any questions so far and yeah we hope this update is fine for you as a first pass but as mentioned before please keep in mind that meta human is uh, still in development and things might change in the future and we have to adapt to these changes as well so you always have to get your um, meta human export from bridge to um, our project and then you get the different um, meta human types so here are a few samples uh, let's go to a skeleton mesh here and i select this face and i'm gonna change it with another face yeah and this is something um you gotta have to do on your end because it's not allowed by epic to um submit our stuff created with meta humans but that's pretty easy for you you just have to migrate your meta human data into your project and play around with these meshes okay that's it from my side have a great day ciao